This is a 1000 liters per hour reverse osmosis water purifying machine made by Tasmat Limited. Raw water from the storage tank flows into the machine through this booster pump, which pumps water through the fiber reinforced vessels. From the booster pump there is chlorine dosing which takes place before water proceeds to the fiber reinforced vessels. The first vessel consists of graded sand medias that is a sand media A which comes on top sand media B which comes at the center and sand media C which goes to the bottom. The first vessel consists of graded sand medias that is a sand media A which comes on top sand media B which comes at the center and sand media C which goes to the bottom. The purpose of the sand medias is to filter sand particles and suspended solids in the water. Water then proceeds to the second vessel which consists of activated carbon which is used to remove free chlorine, bad odor and taste reduction from the water. Water then proceeds to the filter cartridges which filters dust, sand and other suspended solids in the water. From the filtration process water proceeds to the high pressure pump which pressurizes water through the arrow membranes. Before water gets to the membranes we have an antiscalant dosing to prevent the RO membranes from scaling. The RO membranes are used to reduce the dissolved solids for example sodium and fluoride to the set standards by the WHO. Water flows through the membranes and comes out into two effluent that is the permeate flow and the concentrate flow. Permeate flow is the clean purified water which is granted passage by the membranes. The concentrate flow is the water that is rejected by the membranes that is the waste. The permeate flow that is the purified water collected from the membranes flows through this pipe to the flow meter which measures the amount of water that passes through it. From the flow meter the permeate flows to the ultraviolet sterilizer. The UV sterilizer is used to stabilize all biological impurities found in water for example, bacteria and germs. The clean purified water from the UV sterilizer flows to the storage tank through this pipe and is ready for human consumption. This is a control panel for the following functions. This is a power switch. When it is switched on this red light lights up to indicate that the machine is connected to a power source. The second switch is an operational switch to indicate when the machine is in operation or when the machine is in the process of purifying water. This green light lights up to indicate that the machine is in the process of purifying water. This is a standby light which lights up when the storage tank is filled and thus switching off the purification process. Automatically when the level of water in the storage tank reduces or decreases, the standby light goes out and the green light lights up to indicate that the process of purification has resumed.